January 20th, uh, approximately 2346, alert's been called over at Hudson, a possible uh, domestic. Color reports a possible domestic and building. How's it going? How's it going? Hey, what's up, man? Shall I get a call for domestic? Yeah, 108. 108, we got one for you know. Okay. So there might be two here. Alright, do you know what's going on in 108? Not yet, I just pulled up. So I'm going to go take a look at and then get with my OIC and see if she's got any call for 108. Yeah, I'll, okay. Yeah, let us know then. Okay. Where's 108? Uh, should be. Do you know what building? Yep. Yep. One oh eight's in here. All it says is that he's working on stuff around it sounds like a nice thing. Oh really? First one. They got me on a new route. Fifty-nine, fifty-five. That's one of four one ten. He says right below you. Right below me. Okay. Okay, I, I think. I'm pretty sure. We'll right, take a look at it. Yeah, 
He, does, he, he wanted me to do this for him. Okay. But it's, it's just, I don't want to put it. This is more than one. You make a one point I mean, that's good to have or whatever. It's, it's not really going to help us in this situation. Yeah. Which, um, what, what exactly happened tonight? Yeah. He's he just been all day or something just tonight. Okay. Yeah. What happened today? I don't know. just, the screaming right. I wouldn't touch my husband's in there. Okay. I wouldn't touch him like that. He's seriously mental. You can see it, you know, you can tell. Okay? Has he been diagnosed with anything that you know of? Yeah, he's violent. Has he been diagnosed with any yes, mental health conditions? Yes, he used okay. to go to uh, North Care. I think it was North Care. Okay. When's the last time you went to North Care? He hasn't been because they dropped him over there because his sister messed up. That, I don't know. And I got him over here and I finally got him to see a mental doctor. I mean, yeah. I've got papers that I'm going to fill up and take to him. And he just runs out for the traffic mm -hmm. and flips people off in the traffic. Okay. All right. and what, he, what has he done today? Like, besides the yelling, just and yeah, the and I'm just being pissy, being just being angry all day. Okay. <coughs> how, how long has he been living here with you? This is the second time. Well, how long has he has he been here this time? Oh God! Like weeks, months? No, years? months. It's been months. Okay. But last time he was here. And he caused himself. Because he's not capable of. Yeah. Okay, and today it's just angriness and yelling and screaming. And I smacked the shit out of my third pool. I put a hole in my wall, mm -hmm. threw stuff all over the floor in there. Okay. Uh, pulled a knife on me. You did that today? Or? Just a while ago. Just a while ago. And I smacked the shit out of him. And I'm sorry, but I'm not going to I'm not, I'm not do that. I'm not, I don't lie. You know, I, you know, I should put my hands on him, but I don't know. Mm -hmm. well, have him come out of those thoughts real quick. <laughs> what? Oh, 
going on, bud? I just wore it off. Through what? I just wore it off. Oh, it made you so upset. I told you to put lotion on the legs and I want you to do it because my legs are dry skin. I can't hear with all the noise in here, so you just stay in here. I just blew it off and started cussing her and all that. What's that for, buddy? Because I'm a mom. Because I'm not on medication. You're not on medication? Why not? Because I... We went to her doctor, they supposed to send her another referral to another doctor, and I missed it, so okay. I had to go back to her doctor to get another referral. And yeah. I went on my, well, when I was living at my house, I went to Little Rock mm -hmm. to get on pills, and, and I wouldn't do nothing because I was working at the airport, and yeah. they would ask me, why are you not doing nothing? Because I took, took pills, and, and I was slumbly. Cause I wouldn't do nothing to them, I would do nothing to so. And then, and then when I went back, they took me off of it and I quit going cause they said they wasn't going cause I was off on medication. Yeah. Remember what you take, or when you're taking it, what is it? I forgot what I was taking, I forgot cause the, my mom was doing my pills for me when I was living with her. Okay, what's it, what's it for, what's your diagnosis? It was making me calmed and and all that. Like and anti-anxiety Yeah, that's what I was like taking that. and after that they took me off. I went back up for don't look I was slum eating and I said, well that's the only thing that calms you down and they took me off and I said, since I've been going off on everybody, my family and hurt and everything. Yeah. <laughs> How long have you been off of it? I've been off for a while since my grandpa passed. I've been off of it. How are you feeling right this second? I'm scared. You're scared? What are you scared of? You're not in any trouble, bud. <laughs> she just wants to get you help more than anything, man. Yeah. Yeah. Now, if you're in trouble with us, you'd already be in handcuffs and stuff, right? Yeah. Not just talking to us. Yeah, you're not in handcuffs. <laughs> Ouch. What happened? I don't know where I got it from. I mean, I bring up some lotion. And um, and Rachel bought lotion and I won't ever put it on because it goes away and it comes back and stuff. Mm -hmm. Probably got to keep up with it, you know? Yeah. Consistency. Because <laughs> when I was living in Mississippi with Christine and Brother Robert, I didn't have this. And when I came back to my house, I started getting it. And my wife, what's that stuff on the legs? I don't know what that's from. Okay. Can I say something? We're talking to him. I'll talk to you in a minute. Okay. If it's just a minute. So thank you. Hey, here we are, right, man. Take some deep breaths. Take deep breaths. Yeah, let's get calm down first, man. Take some deep breaths. Blow it out hard. Oh, there you go. Like trying to blow a tornado. It helps, man. Trust me. See a doctor or somebody tonight? Might, might help you calm down. Yeah, you know, maybe they can get get you some new med started or something. Yeah. Have you ever been to the crisis center? Yeah, I've been down in Mississippi. I have. Have you been to the one here? Yeah, my mom put me in one long time ago. <coughs> That's not a place for me to be. And because my mom and my grandma was missing me, and every time I called, I didn't have a phone or nothing. Well, we have one here, but they'll, they'll let you use a phone and everything, but yeah. they'll, they'll get you some help too. Talk to some counselors and mm -hmm. maybe get your meds fixed and all that good stuff. Yeah, I think that'd be a good idea. What happens if we leave and you stay here? Are you going to be able to calm down and keep yourself calm? You think so? Because when we got here, I could hear you all hollering and stuff in there. We can't have that at you night. You did? Yeah, I did. Uh, you want these parts, don't you? Me? No. Only when, get, only when people call the police. Oh. He does. Yeah. Yeah, he does. Oh, you work here? Yep. 
Is that one you seen at one time when I, when I took Chad away to go peeing and you look like, who that person lives there? That might have been. I've been up here a couple times. This one when it caught me down. Yeah, it's calms me down because cause, cause when I got in my mouth, I do this, mm, I can not say anything. Mm -hmm. Nothing mm -hmm. calms me down and stuff. Okay. Do you have your own room here? No, I'm just staying with that too. We supposed to be getting plays. And... Well, I mean, do you have your own bedroom in here? Or? No. no I'm... I sleep there. At my house, I didn't have my room at my house. I was sleeping in the front room at my own house. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You're not feeling like you want to hurt yourself, are you? No, I shouldn't have pulled the knife on her up. No, you shouldn't have. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not a good thing to do, man. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to hurt her, do you? No, that's not right. <laughs> <laughs> it's not for an ivory. It's not a screw. Do you want to go to the hospital? No. no. Okay. Do you want to go to the crisis center? Not tonight. I probably, I probably dip before I go to sleep because I'm about to fall asleep. Okay. Well, you, you got you to gotta stay quiet, okay? You, can't be yelling and hollering at each other and all that good stuff, okay? Because you've got neighbors here that live above you and on all sides of you. When they start hearing that stuff, they're going to call us and we're going to have to come back out. And if we have to come back out, we're going to have to do something. You know what I mean? I'm just a more than my friends, bro. For sure, Shane. They've been nice enough to step up and help you out. Yeah. Don't burn that bridge. Yeah. I mean, you got a nice warm place to stay. A lot of people. Not cold there, out there? Yeah, I was out there early. We took the dogs out. Me and Shane took the dogs out. Yeah. We both got that freezing rain. We didn't ever get it. It looked like it's starting to snow tonight. It might. I don't know. But you got a nice warm place to stay. Don't don't screw that up. Yes, sir. Because if you screw that up, you might be out there on the sidewalk. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You don't want that. I've been in the streets before. I took them that hurt a lot. Yeah. All right. Well, let, let us talk to her real quick, okay? All right. I can yeah. 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 You know, you fan, I just got the shirt. I'm gonna go use fan. Okay. Well, you're from Mississippi? Yeah, because I, I had somebody play for and they quit playing. Yeah. So, and so, and so, and so, and I knew her friend Patricia, they're no youth fan. Yeah. And, and so, when I got me a birthday shirt, I said, give me a new youth shirt. And I got the youth pillar and stuff. And, I seen it on the games at my house, and, I, and they're, they're doing good now. This year, they're not doing doing good anymore. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's up to your eye, man. It's just itchy or something. No, it gets red when I rub it. Well, you just fix you, you can fix it by just what you said, right? It gets red when I rub it, so don't rub it. Rub it. Mm -hmm. There we go. How do y'all get to be police officer, carry goods and all that, and not in handcuffs and stuff? Like when I was born at the hospital, they stamped my birth certificate police. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> well, you gotta go through the academy and all sorts of stuff, you know? Yeah, cause, cause the down in Mississippi, uh, my friend Kristen and Robert uh, took, me to me, took me to a big old park. And they was gonna chase me out of the right? And I got scared because they didn't know what to say. I'm done. Yeah. Well, Robert told me to get the driver's seat. I said, I don't know what to do. I don't know what What's your, what's your name? You start getting worked up, just take some deep breaths. Okay? It's amazing what oxygen in your lungs can do. Because mm -hmm. I got scared because I didn't know how to put the car in drive. And I threw it through the windmills and put the brake on, pushed it in drive because there was no cars around. Mm -hmm. it, it was a big empty park. So we drove around and Christy's singing on nervous. Robert's right here. And I'm, 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 Christy was in the back seat and, and I drove around the park because the trenches can't drive because they know I can't read or write. She, she says you've been running out in front of cars. You've been doing that? Yes. What? Oh, no. You're gonna ruin a perfectly good car. We don't want to do that. They won't let you get hurt either. You understand? 
And what if it's a mama with her two little kids and they see you jump in front of them and you splatter all over the road, right? I'm the one who cries too. That'd make everybody sad, right? You gotta stay in here. You get frustrated, figure out a, put a dip in, yep. deep breaths. Hell, do some push ups, man. Because I graduated out of high school. Yeah. You got my plumbing and now. I've been showing off since I've been here. How old are you? I don't know. You have to ask her because it's on my ID. I don't know because I'll forget how old I am now. You don't know how old you are? <laughs> well, I guess I can't give you a birthday card then. Because uh, cause, <laughs> cause, cause <laughs> my first birthday came. I was running out there. He bought me a nice cake yeah. and I didn't ask her to. And we had a birthday party here and everybody was all invited and I was happy. And we said, You didn't have to buy me a birthday cake. I told him not to give it to food system. I'm not sure be nice because you live with us. So I bought me a birthday cake. And yeah, it is new when I turn a little bit. Y'all like driving the race cars? It's better than walking. I've been to one of them before at my house when I was down at the corner. Mm -hmm. That woman next to the, on the side of the street called and, and asked, What's going on? I told my one off of my family. So we'll take you down and straighten you up because me and my sister are not getting along. And they told me to go to my room and shut my door. And they told him not to bug me. And after that, they didn't bug me after the cops left. Oh, yeah. and they told me, You can do whatever you want in your room. They came in and apologized to me. We're sorry for it. I'm not trying to pull it off. Deep breath, Arnie. Come on, man. Yeah, keep Look at these shades. Yeah, they make this. They make the whole shade? How come they don't make him shade? I'm on a different department. He made a good choice in life. So, we y'all have to clean up for y'all to work on y'all. Yeah, unfortunately. Well, so. I can do that. I'd be scared of getting dressed up and go to work every morning, be out there in the cold, taking people to jail, busting them, taking their drugs, and all that. I see that on TV. Yeah. I said, man, I'll be in this I'll be part of my lap either. You want to go there and say you're sorry for your actions and then calm Thank yourself you. down? I want to see you do, I want to see you do without getting all emotional. Just straight shoot it down. Sorry, I'm going to bed. Do you think, do you think tomorrow you go to the hospital they take you? To bad they take you? Yeah. Yeah. Deaconess? Deaconess is probably your quickest. Deaconess. Bad is full. Yeah. Yeah, you need to get a medication, all right? Why don't you take my thing with the They'll help you get all that stuff. Yeah, don't worry about that. All right, no need to stress about that. You just need to give you some rest tonight. Yeah. But go make sure you say you're sorry for all your shenanigans. Go apologize to her, throw you a big old dip in, take you a little nap on the couch, okay? All right, get to it, brother. Good luck, man. We're standing right here. All right. You can do it. You got it. I know you can. We missed Sunday's bath day, didn't we? See ya, appreciate y'all.